because I will not be convinced that the Jets are comfortable with our interior offensive line help be, right now is Wes Schweitzer, Jake Hansen, and Xavier Newman. And that's right. just not good enough, especially because one of the things that I mentioned all offseason was my biggest fear with Elijah Vera Tucker playing guard is the Achilles because you have to load up. When you, when you set your anchor as a guard, all of that weight's going down your legs and you need to have a high-level backup there. For me, the number one target, the person that if we're looking in the interior of the offensive line, if we can convince this guy to come, I would definitely try and sign him is uh, Dalton Risner. The, uh, he played left guard with the Vikings. Yep. I know he signed in the middle of the year last year, but I think Dalton Risner is wildly underrated. And I think that you could definitely bring him in for a cost controlled deal to be a really, really high level backup. And then the other thing, the other player that I would bring in, and I think that we might hear this announcement sooner rather than later is Connor McGovern at center to bring him back as just center guard depth. He's familiar with the, with the system. He's familiar with what's going on. He's probably going to come in with a veteran league minimum deal. If not, if you, if you're not a Connor McGovern guy, another person would be uh, Nick Gates of the Washington commanders would be a guy that I would consider has center guard depth, but you 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 have to bring in somebody to 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 shore that up to 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 beat to fill the bodies there because you know you can feel comfortable that not everyone's gonna make it through. And we gotta wait because one of the news reports that came out is that former New York Jet left us for a starting job. Um, in Pittsburgh, then didn't get the starting job, and then they drafted a bunch of guys. Is Herbig obviously? Billy reminds yeah. me, and, and he might be a cut casualty. And if we can bring Herbig bag back, I would do that because I think he is he was a really, really high level backup. So for me, if it's not wide receiver, which I'm defaulting to you, has to be the interior of the offensive line. And there are still players out there that I think one are available, and then there are guys that might become available that can definitely elevate that room. I like it. And I, let me ask you, if they did settle on a Connor McGovern, I mean, it's kind of like one of those unspectacular, you maybe could hope for a you know, more shiny uh, toy. Mm -hmm. Would you be satisfied? So if they just went out there and gave Connor McGovern one of those $2 million contracts one year, are you happy? Are you satisfied? Or you're like, okay, we're good. No, no, no. If you, you either get a high level backup, a guy who's going to cost you anywhere from three to five million dollars, you're because I think that's what Risner is going to cost. I think Dalton Risner is going to cost anywhere from three to five million dollars. But if you don't go that way and you'd rather bring in two guys, like you either bring in one guy at around three to five million dollars or you bring in two guys at two to one to two million dollars. That's the way that I look at it. So if you brought back Connor McGovern, cool. What else? You, there has to be a there has to be something else because you can't just give Wes Schweitzer, Xavier Newman, and Jake Hansen the backup jobs. Even with and 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 I know that we might disagree on this. I believe that they're probably gonna look at Max Mitchell as an interior offensive lineman in terms of depth and support uh with the drafting of Olu. Even with all of that, you have to bring it like you in a perfect world, Jake Hansen, Xavier Newman, and Wes Schweitzer, two of those guys are gone before week yeah. one in a yeah. perfect world. Two of those guys are gone. I, I don't agree. think Wes is going anywhere, but you can definitely get out from under the court, the, the Xavier Newman contract and the Jake Hansen contract. So go get better on the interior. What's up guys. Matt O'Leary from talking jets. If you liked that video, please make sure to subscribe and follow for more New York jets content.